looking at Tyler Perry with this afro. <laughs> it's even wilder. If he has his afro in this whole movie, it's, it's crazy. <laughs> you are so get ready, dude. Oh, yeah, it's a good one. This is going to be a good one. <laughs> A million right there on a Sunday. Woke up, I made two million on a Monday. You is my son, you will be me on one day. I am too humble, that's my first one. Welcome to another episode of Kickback TV. My name is Cam. Nice to see y'all again for this, you know what I'm saying, new episode. Uh, also, shout out to my guy Trail, man. He here with us in spirit. He couldn't be here today, you know what I'm saying. We gonna we gonna keep back extra hard for my boy. Hello, it's your boy Yay the Kid over here in the corner again, here for another feature film, <laughs> as we call it over here. You know what I mean? When we start calling them feature films, don't worry about all of that. Just go with it. Oh, okay. 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 Just ruin it. Just go. Go. Ruined. Keep doing your Just thing. Just ruin it. But no, y'all know what I mean. Another feature film with the boys again. We might act the fool, we might not get serious, have impactful conversations, strong conversations. Nah, let me stop being dramatic. <laughs> but nah. <laughs> I was like, what are you talking about? But nah, my boy is telling me that the movie that we're watching today. A Family That Prays. Yes. It's Tyler Perry's A Family That Prays. Another Tyler Perry movie to jump in the chronicles of Kickback TV, Paul. So he's telling me I'm gonna have, have fun with this one. Yeah. Hey, for those of y'all that have seen this movie, I, I, I'm trying to tell them, bro. It's crazy. It's crazy. It's crazy. It's crazy. It's crazy. Um, let me see. The gist of the movie is is you got a black woman, you got a white woman. They go on a road trip, and their kid got your kids got a lot of drama going on. Okay. And that's all I'm telling. Okay. That is it. Tom Perry got weed, but you seen that. Yeah, I told you, Tom Perry, this afro is all weird. It's already tripping me out, so. <laughs> it's already starting out great. <laughs> it's starting out great. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, I guess. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Sophie. It's all right. 
Y'all seen me. Yes. Like I said, help him with his stone. Taraji, you don't be like that. This might be so, but we don't know nobody that's gonna give us a shot, number one. And number two, nobody gonna give us no money to start up no company. We need to have a little bit more faith. Where you getting money from, dude? That's all right. Get our business plan together. Old man Jackson already said that his brother-in-law works down at the bank. That's all we gotta do is go down there and talk to him. I don't know. Well, That's so old man sure Jackson, brother-in-law. That's not your brother-in-law. That don't mean we can get that money. At all. Not in the building. She got that corporate money. <laughs> that corporate money. <laughs> yeah, it's there. Huh. <laughs> I'm not gonna be here long. <laughs> Say you're gonna give me that money, don't play me like that. I'm just so tired of her looking down her nose at us like we didn't live in the same house or, or in the same neighborhood. I didn't like it then, and I don't like it now. I don't like it know, oh, it's cold for your ghetto. <laughs> That's crazy. It's corporate, it's corporate talk. It's corporate for your ghetto. <laughs> in the situation she said she was cool she cool let it go she'll much rather not see y'all niggas beef about it take this and stop talking about my mama <laughs> don't worry about this me your boy went to sissy law cabinet for me your boy went to K K jury yeah this one is <laughs> <laughs> yeah that's what I'm saying Shit too? Uh -huh. Okay. Oh, you the man been shifty, dude. <laughs> I don't trust this man. 
you talking about some he a good good dude give him a good job you see he got his, his wife that since his log cabin necklace i bet he did to help his <laughs> whatever's going on in this head what's going on with you i'm good i'm good oh uh, <laughs> so now <laughs> They gave yeah. you this house and a Mercedes, brother. I wish they treated the brother. Brother, <laughs> brother. <laughs> brother. Maybe I need to talk to this, Mr. Carter. Why? Right. I just got some ideas. This one. Mm. He doesn't see construction workers. But I'll tell him for you. You see how she said, like, ooh, her ooh. sister was right. Ooh, that would have got me. I'd have like, what you? She, like, hold on, bro. She too snooty. You know, I always wanted to start my own construction company. You know, I'm just thinking maybe, you know, he has all those contacts. He might be willing to give me one of the smaller jobs that he passed on. Maybe even for me with some of the star money. Don't be stupid. I ain't gonna lie. No, nah, you're is rude. You. That is crazy, but you rude he's about it. He's a tight millionaire with a lot of better things to do. He's I'm not trying to get out any handouts. I'm not asking for mm. any handouts. Chris. What? Yes, you are. <laughs> that's that's exactly what he asked. <laughs> yeah, right. I'm crazy for asking for all of that <laughs> shit, but the way she responded to it is crazy, too. Okay, Chris, thank you. Okay. Yeah. Chris, I love you, man. Chris, my head hurts. I had no time. That's crazy. <laughs> See, that's crazy. That is crazy. <laughs> Look at him. What the hell? <laughs> what? Can you stand it? My girl. What's up? Was made the same year I was born. Oh, no, he, got, he got bread money. I got it today. Why? Yeah, about your little suit. Oh me, she said it meant a little suit. I have this idea. I want us to drive across country. Like Oprah and Gail. Oprah and Gail don't have a down in the run. I got business to do, honey. Well, so do I. No, you got too much time on your hand entirely. Obviously. Alice, that smell burning. Alice, Evans, you're so rubber when we hit the road, Alice. Come on, let me take you for a spin. I got good corn practice. Well, that's perfect. Come on, look at me. Ride with me, baby. How did you get here? Like I drove, baby. We yeah, finna see how you drove. You got to take off the emergency brake bag. That's the smell. You burning out the transmission. Oh no. Yeah. Yeah. We like. we on the road now, baby. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm finna walk to choir. I'm finna walk to church. I'm not riding with this one. We on the road now. <laughs> oh my god. This afro is just wild. Why are they having fried chicken on Wednesday? What the dude, girl? Ooh, this is the chicken boogie on me. Burgs work. Chris, all day long talking about a star now with the trust company. Well, have you given any thoughts? Where are you kicking me? Where are you get that money from, Taraji? He wants us to go to Cartwright and ask him for the money for the star. Hmm? And? Excuse me, Scott, I know we work for you. Can you give us three hundred thousand dollars so we can become your competition? I love black people. Where's money? That's crazy, right? Like when you put it out like that, like that, that's the way I seen it. Hey, she on the place. He make a way. He make a way. Yes, ma'am. That nigga got on ER scrubs. <laughs> he just got on for work. <laughs> Yes, yes. 
receive it. I love, I, love, I love how she she's soaking in the Jesus. Yes, Miss Kathy Bates, receive it. You no, know she invited to the cookout. Yes. Oh yes, Lord, you invited. You're tearing. Yes, receive it. It's, I know it's a strong force, but he gonna make a way for you. Thank you for being my true friend. Oh, dang. You gotta thank me for that. Sunday practice. Are you sure you're not going to off country with me? I am so sure. Hey, friendship. Oh, oh, one of the better parts of the movie. William, come on in here and meet Miss Abigail Dexter. Hello? All right. All right. If he could say, who the fuck is this, he would have let that off. Right. Abby was just telling me she thinks she can take this company global. Oh, well, mother, we already have. I just signed the Hong Kong account. We're building a new towers in Los Angeles. Wow, that's great. Puff Face said, who the what fuck told you to do any of that? Who told you to do that? <laughs> Boy, I'm finna ask this woman to leave real quick. <laughs> Cause that was crazy what you just told me. Why are you here? I just told this young thing was Miss Sunshine. She's gonna be our new COO. Ooh, high, high, high position. Because you keep Miss telling Lisa, me that you can't you do the job right. Is this the part where you cry now to me? I thought you were considering me for that position. Yup. <laughs> <laughs> Why on earth would you think that? All right. Why? Because I'm your son. That's why. That's nice. I would expect you to bring the sex up to speed. Mm -hmm. Is it clear? Yes, mother. He had no choice, so go ahead and get a bag. Thank you. Well, you're tripping, talking about he signed with Hong Kong. What? Did I tell you? Why are you doing things without <laughs> telling me? Huh? What was that? <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna stop you right there. You haven't even looked at the proposal yet. We're just not. I don't need to. Time to take this kind of risk. Not in the position. What you're asking me is impossible. It's not impossible. Look at Tyler Perry just sitting there like I told you. Bro. If you just look at the proposal right there. Thank you. Thank you. Don't leave. We not even dressed correctly. We just ain't got no overalls. Right, we just, you just, what you thought was gonna happen? <laughs> Sorry, it says here, Adrian and Christopher Bennett, same social. Yeah, I know she's my wife. There's more than one account. Yes, sir. Okay, so what's the balance on it? $286,000 and 43 cents. Girl, what, what the hell you just tell me? Where that money come from? I'm finna bust in this meeting right now. What in the hell is this two hundred and eighty? <laughs> no. I'd have been shocked as hell when you said which account. Hmm? <laughs> what do you mean which? It's only one. It's a joint. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> it's two. This is a solid deal. Mm. This company stands to have record highs in the first quarter of over a lot. Don't interrupt me when I speak. Mm, I'm over you though, but okay. I made this deal on the strength of this company. It's a good deal. Are you done? Is that all you had to say? All right. We're overextended with the four projects we're involved in now. And now you go and sign a deal that makes us liable for $25 million that we don't have right now. This company's cash poor. This is a publicly traded company. Surely we can raise $25 million. You, want, you didn't even check to see if y'all had that money to spend? Nigga. No. I see why your mama don't listen to you. You a dummy. That's why she. A law degree, or my master's in finance, or my 15 years of experience that would qualify me. Right. And not allow. What do you have? An agreement that is so top-heavy would bring this company to its knees. 
Do you understand? He ain't making no money, dude. Shut up. Shit, we losing money, idiot. I was just checking up. All right, that's not for me. Just thought I'd stop by. Maybe take my hard working husband to lunch. Just want to make sure you're okay. I guess. <laughs> How's your husband, Christopher? Michael? Yeah, uh, he's good. Doesn't he work for the company? Yeah, on the construction side. Right. She ain't trying to talk to you. Move. Andrea. Hmm. hmm. That's a lovely fragrance. Uh, no, I knew it. He smelled like Kente oil. Boy, I knew she it. She smelled like Kente oil. That's why he got up off of her so quickly like that. That woman took that good whiff. No, no, dude. What are you talking about? Remember when I went to the bank and I looked at the teller? I walked to the teller. He said, "Why you mad? You brought up another account with Andrea's name on it." You didn't go home and say nothing about that. Better call her, man. I'm not talking to her. I'm, I'm not even sure that I want to know. That's not she my place. Five thousand dollars a year. <laughs> Such a lame man. <laughs> Where the fuck? <laughs> that man is. He's a wild. He's a wild man. He's a passive dude. Bro. Yeah. Right, where the fuck does money come from? How do I get out of it? I think that that would be bad for business. This company's going to sue every investor. Well, we're gonna have to find a way to raise some capital. Call Raleigh over Bank of Australia. Mother, with the housing market being where it's at, we're gonna have to shut up. This is an awful situation, but there is a solution. I'll be imposing. If we sell 10% of the stock, I will not hear of it. Right. That puts me in the minority. Right. My vote won't matter. Uh-huh. Can't have no, it. Mother, I still have a percentage in the company. I don't trust you. Mrs. Cartwright, he is your son. Ms. Dexter. My family has been known to prey on the weak. Would you trust them? No. You don't trust me. Fuck no. Ten percent. Yeah. Sell it. Smart choice. That's mm -hmm. Look at it. I know you're up to something. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Did you do a dumb deal just so I could have to sell my state? If you burn me, I will nail your ass to the wall. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Your mama would say she's gonna whoop you. <laughs> Lame man, dude. You know what, sister? I think we got off on the wrong foot. Maybe I can take you to dinner sometime. No. She won't come. Sure. Me and my husband would love to. Right. To bring your wife. You're married, punk ass dude. I went to the bank. Oh god, that's how I was stuck in the house. No, it's 200 something thousand dollars. <laughs> yeah, thank you. You see it? Yeah. What are you doing with this? I was wondering myself. <laughs> you know? <laughs> Where the hell did all this money come from? Because I, I can't make it. <laughs> But if you keep pissing me off, then we are going to have a problem up in here. Oh, <laughs> foot I get bonuses at work. I get bonuses at work. What type of damn bonuses you get? You got 200K. Yeah. <laughs> Stop <laughs> lying to me. You will never be William Cartwright. There you go. He can carry on a conversation with the business world without stuttering. He's charming. He went to Harvard. Oh, Harvard. Okay. Get over it. Oh, so you fucking him. I'm still stuck on charming. You because why is face. that even? Why are we even speaking on that? So, uh, that's why I heard she fucking him. Right. Now put my mail back in the envelope and put it back in the drawer where you found it. You do it, you a bitch, nigga. Girl, I'll leave your ass. Have some Tonight. respect. Coming. 
You gotta have some respect, dude. Nah, he gonna go cry and put it up. Harry. Yeah, you said that. Yeah, you said that. How much? I don't know. Tallest. Almost three hundred thousand. Taller boy. Ha <laughs> ha. You just started something, bro. <laughs> Come on, Tallest. Here you go now. <laughs> she gonna have to hear from Buddy now. Now, her sister. I mean, like, at least she know this. Yeah, yeah. She yeah. know her brother-in-law. He ain't yeah. out there. Yeah. He ain't gonna do nothing. Soft as baby shit. You come to see me, y'all? No, I did not. I got my bags in your car. Yeah. We on the road, Alex. Girl, come on, get up. I knew that was gonna make her happy. Ben told me about all that money you got in the bank, and I just want to make sure it's legit on you. And why is it any of your damn business? Because Mama got you that job. That's what makes it my damn business. I get bonuses. Oh. Okay. Here she goes and bonus. Angela, go in the car. 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 Angela, go Jeez, before you walk in on these folks like this. Hello. I, I was wondering if my wife was right. Your wife? Yeah. Andrew Bennett? Oh. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Divorce her. <laughs> What are you what? apologizing for? Mr. Carver, this gentleman is just leaving. Gentlemen. Hey, Mr. Carver, uh, Chris. I'm sure he's a suspect. It's been a long time. How are you doing? Yeah, Hi. I, I'm Abigail Dexter. I'm Michelle. Nice to meet you, Abigail. Yeah, I know that you're married. That is crazy. You see how everybody's doing so this slick that. shit? I would have peaked it. Yeah. Um, you're being the prestige building. Oh, wow. You know what? She didn't tell me about that, so I... She don't tell me a lot of things. She want you, Andrea. Look at her. Well, you should be there. Bitch. Okay. Oh, that's okay. crazy. Well, is everything's going well out there? Yeah, yeah, Mr. Carver. Everything's going well down at the site. So, good. Well, let me know if you need anything, okay? Well, actually, well, Mr. Carver... Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Don't. <clears throat> what is it? It's probably not. You're a hush. Let me talk. Listen. Right. You see how she showed up with her? I said, shut up. She's yeah. Crazy. It's fun. <laughs> hey, where we going next? I don't know. That's the beauty of it. Get up and drive. Just wake up and go where we want. Okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I guess. <laughs> My child ain't speaking to me because I didn't promote him. Why did he promote him? Well, let's not forget the hell he put me through. Four years at Harvard and three years of rehab. Yeah. He got it together. I told mm. you he would. Don't be so hard on him. Yeah, not yet. <laughs> let's let's not take it so easy. That nigga's devious now. Sometimes you say the simplest thing ain't so much. It's just the truth. I made mine up, but they ain't gonna kill me. Man, that's valid. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck your kids. <laughs> yeah, put some play. Let's see for that yak. Yeah. <laughs> All right, there you go. I feel closer to heaven when I'm drinking. Shame on you. Yeah, stop talking like that. You know I go to church. <laughs> you know, I was thinking about starting my, my own construction company. I mean, much smaller than this, of course. Yeah. <laughs> of course, of course. Well, you get to start somewhere. Well, right. I was wondering, maybe you would like to invest. I'm investing in something, all right. Do you have any other investors? 
Well, none. You, you are you are the first 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 time. You know I work very closely with your wife, and I'll get back to you through her. How's that? Uh, yeah, yeah. Ask something about that. Okay. Follow up questions. The board and I have decided to go on. You see what I'm saying? This nigga sneaky, bro. Yes, yes. This is my husband, Mr. Mosby. That's a lovely necklace. That is lovely as yours. Question. Excuse me. Where she get it from? Where she get it from? Chris, right? Yes, ma'am. It's me. How are you? I'm good. Notice anything different, Chris? You look very handsome. You seen that petty, sneaky shit? You look very handsome. Coford, you better watch out, bitch. I fuck your man. <laughs> I got money too. Why are you looking for anything to embarrass me? I'm gonna divorce you so tough. So, put it to a nice pretty little fit to a place like this. Alright, big jam, man. I'm saying what? Can I go on more? Well, not quite. I'm I'm Thelma. And this is my friend Louise. Louise. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. So, how'd you all meet up? You should all ask a lot of questions. Right. Well, we're friendly around these folks. Well, if you must know, my husband was doing a developmental deal in an urban area, and she refused to sell. So, he sent me and the sweet talker into it. I never met anybody as strong will in all my life. I've been friends ever since. Well, me, she been my nigga ever since. I was 30 years ago. I can't say that, but I'm saying it for her. Me <laughs> <in me too. laughs> Shorty in the back going crazy. <laughs> <laughs> you want to dance? I knew it. Mm -hmm. You got a holiday dance? A holiday dance? No. I didn't think you did either. Right. You don't talk about Jesus, you ain't talking to me. Go ahead and walk off, brother. Have you seen my wife? Oh, I haven't. Yes, she has. Maybe. She's a good There you go. What do you mean by that? Is the follow up question, bro. Oh, y'all gonna laugh in my face. Imagine what you should drink. No, I'm good. No, you're not good. I'm trying to help you out here. I'm trying to help you keep the job. Oh, okay. Fine then. Take your ass home. <laughs> You're fired. <laughs> Get out of here. He's been talking to Bex about starting some company. And a few people have told me that he's trying to contact some of our competition for help. Well, he can't be persistent. You know, I don't like it. It's not good for business. So I'm going to fire him. Back your plot on your husband. Ooh, I swear, for Lord, I'm gonna divorce you. Yes, yes, Woo! yes, yes. You're done. Uh huh. Oh, there's nobody there. Keep doing your business. Yes. Excuse me, Mrs. Have you seen my wife? Follow up questions, Chris. Go upstairs, Chris, because you're gonna get fired anyway. Follow up question. Oh, this you go. Oh yeah, I'm enjoying my. Oh yes, ma'am. Come here. Yeah, I'm gonna talk to you. Baby. Okay. Well, I smack you on the back of your bald head. You okay. don't. You don't ask the good questions, Chris. Okay. okay. You don't ask the good questions, Chris. Yes, yeah, yes, sir. Come on out here. You left the party early. Mm. Do you love her? Ooh. That's the question. She asked the good questions. The, uh, the the most valid one that needs to be answered. Dig deep. Dig deep. Big step. Look at him. I'm cold. You got it. 
William, this is not a hard answer. I love you. It's not the. It's not the answer to the question she asked. You know that was bullshit. Holy and sanctified. Alex, Whatever she wants in that bar, yeah, so come on. It's the, it's the Jesus. The Jesus. Chee Chee. Me. Receive it. Woo, I know it's refreshing. You heal. No, don't. Yeah. Girl, you yeah, lower your voice around these Christian folk, man. You saved. <laughs> you saved. <laughs> Take it now. <laughs> That's crazy. Andrea. Mm -hmm. We gotta talk. Do you think I can see you for a moment, please? Sure. I'm gonna cut this passive aggressive shit out. You know that we have a strict no fraternization policy here, right? Mm. I'm very aware of it. Oh, okay. I've been a lot fraternizing, though. Well, the things that concern me are several thousand dollars of purchases that seem to be personal. Hotel stays every Wednesday. Hmm. Using the company money? Right. I can't protect you if you're going to be honest with me. I don't need you to protect me. Well, I got a car right. Do you think he will? I know he will. You just admitted it, stupid. <laughs> They know, like I said, this, this is a game. Cat and mouse. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Your sisters like you, they give us all the bad names. Woo! Screwing your way to the top instead of doing it the right way. The right way. The right way is graduating top of my class, getting my master's, and helping this company report record profits. But yo, you, you graduated and didn't do any of that. You, you, you popping that, 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 that twat did. You know what I'm saying? We're going to have to let you go. We'll see. He has no authority to keep you here. And you have no authority to make me leave. Who don't? Who don't? If you say so. Girl, if you don't shut the fuck up and get this box and pack your shit up. <laughs> like I said, I get secretary woman. <laughs> you better slow down before you get a ticket. <laughs> I got, I got you. I got you. Uh huh. I got some old thing, dog. Repentance. Repentance. <laughs> yes. Find Jesus. <laughs> Get out of here, yes. devil. Oh no. Oh, uh, oh. I, I got this Bible for yeah, you. I'm gonna thump your ass with a Bible, dude. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Uh huh. Y'all yeah. don't like this in here. <laughs> it burned, don't it? That stupid ass smell my face. Oh, uh, uh, she looked a little intrigued. <laughs> she is rethinking. <laughs> what you doing? I can't move this camera. Okay. It just keeps just saying memory pull. Okay. Don't it's touch it. me. Don't touch me. Look at me. What is it? Yeah, chop, chop it up with me. That whole memory card thing was crazy. Yeah, I see why she was freaking out. Because it's like a symbolism for her brain. Like, you can't just slot out your new memory card, bro. It's going to be all right, Charlotte. Hey, I'm here for you. Not this time. Not this time. Not this time. We've been through a lot of things together, Alice. That's okay. That's, that's life, you know? Not this time. I'm going to be here for you. Whatever, however y'all want. It's not gonna be all right, but I mean, I'm glad you're here, type shit. Hey, how's it? Who did he do that for? Chris? Can we find Tyler Perry too? Why? Probably was talking about a song. I don't 
company. Who you talk to? Oh, I didn't talk to anybody at the party, man. Why is he fucking lying like he didn't sit here and talk to Carl, right? Just... No, 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 no. Well, he needs to know this. Carl paid the mortgage to no job. I was doing fine, we on our feet, and you. Listen, maybe this is just a sign. Maybe we need to come to our own business. Shut up. Chris, what the hell? Hey, baby. Uh, listen, let me explain, okay? I, I, I took all the money out of the bank. I know that. Open up the business. Ha ha! Did what? You heard me? Ass. I ain't got money to dip my hair. You better quit playing with me. Shut up, nigga. Just drop it. Shut up. You stole my money. Maybe. Even this loser will never be William Cartwright. From one. Stop. Right. Right. That shit never worked on me. I'm not your punk ass husband. Ooh. Who are you talking about? Shut up. It's in your face. She'll do something like that. That's not in her nature. Still, nigga, to even play like that is dumb as fuck. That just shows you how cocky he is. I think you should know. Your son is planning a board meeting today. Have you voted out? Mm. Uh, you help me, I help you. I like you a little bit more. Thank you, daughter in law. Do you really think that man's gonna leave his wife and his child for you? Shut up! Shut up! Right, you can scream, don't yes. you know, wrong? Okay. You be a dumb. I'm sure someone told the very same thing to the woman who took daddy from you. You daddy pushed her in her arms. You didn't already push your husband, so you want to push a woman that... You have no idea what happened between me and her father. So you going to act just you like him? no idea. I know that he left us here. He left us 
and he never came back. Say so like just like him? Because it's you. You're right. You ain't gonna blame your mother. And broke. Go get but therapy, dude. Really That's left. bad. That was 30 years ago, and I let it go. You need to, too. Andre, you have to let it go now. You do? You cannot build your life on hurts from the past. Because you're fucking up everybody else's life. It's from a different world, you honey. And he will not marry you. He will. No, he's not. The he loves to pump you. He loves to pump you, sweetheart. Yeah, so I'm about to hold it. What you up to now is only to disaster. The devil's work. Hmm. Well, then I'm gonna enjoy the ride on the way. Oh, your face sealed. I'm uh -huh. glad you you and you grown too. So yes, man. Grown that's all you. Too. That's all on you. Yep. Stop shaking, Taraji, stop shaking your head because y'all been that, telling her, uh, the been whole, warning her. Yes, sir. Move out my way. Bang! Let's get it with Mr. McMahon. Uh -huh. No, you won't believe the day I had. Put them shoes back on. This is all right. Yes. Mrs. Cartwright. That part. I'm yes. glad you got it right. You're pathetic. That's why you're limited to this little room. He Woohoo! You. you think his colleagues would deal with him if he showed up with you on the side? Woo! You stay away from my family. You feel goofy, don't you? Real silly. Because she got the real power. She his wife. You in a hotel room. You feel dumb, don't you? Put your shoes back on, stupid. Come on in here, will you? Oh, you been killing me, though. Come on in here. Get in the room. Yeah. Let's sit down. Let's talk about it. Thank you. Not in your father's chair. In this side chair. Yeah. Yeah. I want to look you in your eyes when I tell you this. There's several decisions that you made, including hiring Mr. Dexter. It's not in the best interest of this company. Oh. Therefore, the board and I have voted to retire. Oh, okay. Is that so? Oh, oh that's nice. Unanimous decision. Unanimous is crazy. And you voted against it. Uh-huh. Oh. Yes. You remember what I said when, what I said when I said Are it? Are you sure every member voted? Austin. It's all except the cavalry company. They've been silent for 15 years. They never voted. Well, maybe it's high time they did. Right. Yes, they are. <laughs> Daddy, would you? Yes, ma'am. Right. Well, why would I not bring them up into this? Three of y'all unanimously scooted the other side. Yeah, it's right. Get the fuck out the way. Unanimous. Yeah, y'all yes. really don't count at all. <laughs> son is over. <laughs> you got jokes with. Have you ever considered looking into the managing members of the Calvary Company? Yeah, you don't know your own your own company, will you? That is my main thing. Yeah. <laughs> Look at him. Austin, don't you mean your colleague? Who? Nicholas? Call me Nick. Yeah. What's going on? Well, Nick was one of the most powerful stockbrokers in this company until your little ego let him go. Mm. Apparently, he's been advising Alice for years. Imagine my surprise when I found out she has quite a few shares in this company. Mm. Well, now that I have the control of both, there are a few changes effective immediately. Uh-huh. Abby, I'd like for you to maintain a COO. Stay with you, player. You're fired. And you get the fuck out, player. All right. Me and Jared. I'll catch y'all boys later. <laughs> this is <laughs> this is I told you you need that money, girl. You never asked me. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, me. You gotta get the fuck out of here. <laughs> they take my money, bucks. I'm not leaving my he can't. No, no, wait. Andre. Wait, you can't do this. Your hands off. You can't. William, no. What do you mean you can't? You can't do this. Please. Because she feels stupid. She left her whole life about. behind. He has a son. Do we? Do we? Wait, wait. Wait, wait. Girl. <laughs> look at you. <laughs> and I'm around my window there to look at you as I drive off, player. Lord Jesus. Look at you. Yes. Yes. I'm gone. Yeah. <laughs> Look at the money leave. When Shauna died, it brought a lot of hurt, tears, and a lot of questions. I remember 
back to my second child was born. She asked me, how is it is? As long as she could say my name. She said, are you living or are you existing? I didn't get what she was saying at the time. But this morning, I could hear her voice. Hey, that's fucking me. Because, like, oh, yeah. Breathe, breathe, please breathe. Deep bros, cause like I don't hate to lose one of my niggas. I thought they ain't giving that money back. No, you didn't give that money back. Got the construction work, construction plates on me, on Andrea. Have fun. And there you go, a little money. Move. Ah, get the fuck up off me. Thank you. Yeah, we ain't got to do all that. Thank you. What's up, young man? Come here, man. I'll see you later. You know I mean? I love you. I'm not here for you anymore, girl. You want know me to come pick you up with your mama house shitty? Let me know. Yeah, she broke. All right, Alice. You have a nice life. I mean, you deserve it. Yes. I love that for Alice. Yes, sir. This is a good film. I like this. I told you. I told you. You're crazy. I like how she is broke. I, I, I would agree with you. What you said earlier in the movie, how Alice and Charlotte has a, a very good relationship. Go like, relationship. very solid. Like, they trust each other with any and everything. And we started to I got your kids back. Boy, and this crazy thing is how, uh, what was that? Catherine was saying how they met each other, basically. She was just sent there to do that whole thing or whatever and they done turned out to just be friends basically because they mm -hmm. they respect each other how they stand up and shit like that they don't back down and i was like that's 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 respectable i like that uh -huh. i like that now they kids that's what she get crazy william like i said it, even at the like the four years before uh, we saw that the time not the time skip but pre pre time skip if, not pre yeah, yeah, yeah pre time skip if you want to say that in the beginning, like I said, I saw, I don't know if it was anything going on with them around that time, but I saw that little, he was little, flirting, he was, yeah. he was pushing up a little bit. Yeah, I saw that going on, so I was like, okay, in my head, I was like, I know y'all finna do some foul shit, it's finna be some wild shit between y'all two, and Buddy over there just ducked out. Chris just you thought, right? my wife loved me, yes. I love my wife. Yes, bro, and like I said, man, I get, like I said, I, don't get me wrong. Bro, bro, Chris is a good dude. Like I was telling you, he's a very good dude, a kind-hearted man. But the woman that he was with and the stature that she was at, mm -mm. no, <laughs> no. She not built for facility. No, that was she not, not She not the, it's, and it sucks, but not all people deserve nice people because they run over them. Bro. Yes, that's, that's a, like a true thing. Like based off this movie, it's a true thing, man. And like I said, he didn't do nothing wrong to that woman. Like I was telling you, everything that he did in his life was something to support his wife and his kid. I'm just trying, like I said, I know what I'm doing is a risk, but what is a risk without taking it? What, I'm like, I, I feel like, and like you said, I feel like if I go out and do this, I'm going to succeed. Because from his work experience, it looks like he, he knows what he's doing. He's him and Tyler Perry. Yeah. And she didn't even want to give him this, like the satisfaction of giving him a chance, helping him out or anything. She just, every time he came up to the tour, she was like, ugh. Yeah, it's like, ugh, you're talking about this again. You're not doing that. You're, you're not Cartwright. Yeah, you're a low, low value man. And that whole William shit, why you keep bringing it up? Like, not Nobody all men. Nobody even talking about him. Right. This was crazy. Not all dudes want to be William. And even, I like when, like, he said, we got Tyler. 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 I'm about your husband. Dude, I'm a, that don't work on me, dude. Nigga, I don't want to be him. That's that man life. I don't want that man I life. Want my life. Yeah. The one thing I will say he was tripping on, right? Is when he took that 200 out without saying anything. But. Before, hold on, hold on. Given the context, he didn't even know what was going on with it. Now, we have the context. Me personally, if I didn't know, I took that shit. No, I said either way, Kevin. I'm say, I don't without think context, was wrong. <laughs> I, think, I think he was wrong because two wrongs don't make a right. She was wrong for hiding this shit. She was wrong for what he treated him when he found out about that shit. He was wrong for taking it without saying nothing. Now, because it worked out at the end, oh God. Yeah. That's the only thing that I would say is his fault outside of the fact that he was being fucking oblivious 
to the fact that his wife was cheating. That's crazy. The silence when it was in his face. People was laughing in his face. His own friend didn't tell him about the shit. Bro. That's that's the crazy. That, thing. That's that's even like I said, the whole coworkers and shit like that. I get that, but your homeboy is my knows, brother-in-law. He knows that I'm getting cheated on. And you know I'm getting laughed at behind my back, dude. But he could have been more, I guess, visual, more using his visuals to see what's going on. Instead of doing the same shit he did, because it seemed like from the movie, like the beginning, he just just act timid around her. I don't want to make you mad, but I do have something to say. And then she shuts it <laughs> down. And I'm like, nigga, dude, talk louder. <laughs> say something. Stop yeah, running up and run over you. And this is something just I know as a man in general. Really, just dating in general. The minute you become a doormat to somebody who's going to run over you, Cook. Yeah, it's over. Like that's, that's all they gonna. That's all that's, that's all gonna, gonna be done is. now. You're a doormat. Earlier, when he did strike her and stuff like that, I was like, uh, oh, that, that part was, too. Yeah, that was crazy. Yeah, but like I said, her. I'm not gonna hold. He was wrong for him. Yeah, but like I said, I'm gonna say it again. You once you do certain shit like that to certain pe- nice people, and you fool mess them over, you're you're not expected to know what they're gonna do or how they're gonna handle the situation. He could, like you said, he could have handled it better and not even hit her at all. Just ended it with her right then and there. But like I said, he warned her earlier, and you keep degrading the man over, over, and over again. When, like I said, all he's trying to do is just be a good dude or whatever towards you, to you, to your mean ass. Oh, like I said, man, other than that, bro, this this movie's good. I give it a, I give it a good. I give it seven point five. I get 7.5. I mean, I can, I can say that. Yeah. And the only thing the only thing I would add on to what you said, because you about summed it up perfectly, it was, it was a small movie. You oh, know yeah. what I'm saying? With, it wasn't nothing too much to talk about. Mm-hmm. But I, the only other thing I would add to that is, y'all be cool. Like, make sure, try not to have bad blood with everybody, bro. And try not to look down on folks. Because oh, yeah. by the end of the movie, my nigga Nick was rich. Like, Fuck everybody on a block rich whole time. And he was just being humble about it because he got fired. He was on hard times. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Y'all heard his backstory. You know, like, 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 don't judge. Like I said, don't judge, folks, bro. Don't you never know who you're going to need. You never know who you're going to need. And I, and I love how they swung back to bite Cartwright in the ass because he fired that nigga because he didn't like what he was saying. Cartwright was a dumbass nigga that didn't know what the fuck he was doing. He was a spoiled child. I love this movie. So I'm going to give it about a, a 7.5. To me, it's one of the top tier non Medea Tyler Perry movies. No cap. Yeah. So yeah, we're going to come with more videos. Uh, let us know what y'all want to see. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, we're going to keep coming, especially with the Tyler Perry movie. We know y'all love them. I ain't going to lie. We love them too. Yeah. So we're going to keep them coming too. And I don't know, bro. Videos over.